What's up guys, it's Keep Moto here. I uh, haven't been around in a long time if you noticed, but I am back, sort of. Um, let me just tell you that I do not have this Honda CBR anymore. Uh, I traded it for something a lot more fun. Um, and I am so glad I did that trade. But the, the, the reason why I don't have the CBR anymore is because I actually had a huge deal of problems happen after riding it. Um, I rode it twice and it bogged down and the engine started making some horrible noises. I actually had someone uh, from my work come check it out and it was, it, he said it was not good. Uh, he just told me to just sell it as it is before it just blows up. So I traded it and this is what I got now. It's a Honda, it's a 1986 Honda XR250R, and man, this thing is a beast. Uh, the only thing that was wrong with it, that it, the carburetor wasn't in it. He just handed me the carburetor when he came to trade it. I say, I'm, I, I know this, you know, especially after trying to work with a four carb, you know, 900 CBR, that one, that one carburetor was pretty, pretty easy. So, cleaned it up, put it in, rode smooth. So damn smooth. And this thing is a beast. I haven't really gone too fast on it because there's really nowhere to go. I mean, you may be seeing all this, but there's fences all right here. I would love to just go in there. But my experiences on a dirt bike is a zero. Um, I've never been on a dirt bike ever. This is the first time ever to be on a dirt bike. You know, so, you know, my skills will slowly go up there. Maybe one day I'll pop a little little power wheelie, but I'm not sure. I don't have, you know, I don't take risk of just dropping my bike. I mean, I can't just drop it and be like, okay, I'll go fix whatever. Just, bro, I can't do that. So, whatever. But, yeah, this is what I got now, you guys. Um, more videos to be coming soon. I still have to uh, street legalize this thing. Uh, it's going to cost me a good deal of money, especially since the guy didn't have a title to it. So I got to get a title. I won't be riding too soon. Uh, hopefully by the time income tax comes in, I'll have the money to uh, get a street conversion kit. I'm not too sure about the uh, supermoto wheels. Those damn things cost about as much as a damn car, uh, uh, used car does. So I'm not sure about those. I might change the tires though to, I'll, I don't know if they even make street tires for these, but I'm sure they got them somewhere. So yeah, I mean it already comes with the tail light, it's already got the, the headlight. Uh, I just got to get the street conversion kit that comes with a little battery because they are, they're not turning on. I still haven't really experimented much with this bike. I've just ridden it today. I put it in the carb about four hours ago and I just started riding the shit out of it and it rides so smooth. It's such a beast for a 250. Uh, this is my first time ever, ever having or riding a dirt bike and <laughs> I've been missing out. I've been missing out a lot. So yeah, you guys, this is, what's, this is what I am now. I guess I'm a supermoto or whatever you want to call a person who rides a dirt bike. Um, uh, motor vlogs are, are coming soon, you guys. Stay tuned, and it's going to be a fun-ass ride. Peace out. Hey, guys, let me also say that I uh, I really appreciate all you guys' support. I've, I just got on fa uh, YouTube not too long ago and realized that I have 195 uh, subscribers, and I was like, wow, and I haven't really done much, and uh, you guys deserve more. So I appreciate y'all guys' support. More videos will be coming soon. I will try my hardest to make as many videos as possible for you guys. Um, and also, if there's anything in particular you guys like, because I'm really not sure what you guys are really interested in in my videos. I'm just doing whatever. Or maybe that's what you like because I'm doing whatever. But yeah, so appreciate you guys. Uh, thanks for all the support. Uh, more videos will be coming soon. All right, thanks, you guys. Peace.